Welcome back to my channel where we explore the extraordinary in the ordinary. Before we dive into today's video, please don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for more content like this. Let's get started. In today's video, we are going to explore one CSS property called font stretch. The font stretch property selects a normal, condensed or expanded face from a font. So sometimes when you have a particular font family, you might need to change the look and feel or those fonts supports little bit or some type of stretch. So using this property, you can apply that stretching to that font. So you need to make sure before using this property, not all fonts support this property. It depends on the font, the font family. Okay. So let's go to one website that is developer Mozilla. And here is very great, nice example given for this font stretch property. As you can see, we have this particular content HTML or you can say demo with font stretch condensed. So let's see what font family is using here. Here you can see we have a font family called League Sans Serif and this font family supports font stretch CSS property. So let me change to font stretch value to expanded. You can see now this content the space between the font, a space between the lines is now expanded. If I change it to ultra expanded, it will add more space between the lines. Similarly, you can also use percentage value. So percentage value 50%, 100%, 150% as well. So using font stretch property, you can stretch the available font. It depends on the font family if this property is supported or not. In this example, it is supporting. So that's why you can see the stretching of this particular font. Expanded, ultra expanded and percentage as well. This 50% looks nice. Okay. So this was the quick introduction about font stretch CSS property. Let's see about the compatibility. As of today, this property is supported by Chrome, the latest Chrome browsers, as well as for Edge, Safari, latest Safari browsers, as well as latest Firefox, Opera, and IE as well. So make sure you check out this page, caniuse.com, before using this property, CSS font stretch property, in your project. All right. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more content. Stay tuned for my next video and hit the bell icon to get notified. Leave a comment down below to let me know what you would like to see next. See you 